Hey everybody, uh, Dagenmar here, and uh, just real quick, I'm going to show you how to install FTB Revelation. Uh, it is a general purpose mod pack for Minecraft, and it is super easy to get installed on your computer. So let's just dive right into it. The first thing you're going to need is the Twitch desktop client uh, that is now the official launcher for FTB. Um, this is what it looks like. If you don't already have it, you can easily get it by just going to app.twitch.tv. Click this download button and uh, install it. You'll be all set. So once you have it running, uh, you're going to... Why does it say I'm streaming? I'm not streaming. Well, that's interesting. I'm going to have to check that out later. Anyway, <laughs> go over to mods and uh, you'll see Minecraft somewhere in here. I don't know if it's going to be the first one on your list, but um, I think it's in alphabetical order, so it'll probably be somewhere. Uh, else on the list. But anyway, here it's uh, first on mine because I've had stuff installed before. I just uninstalled it just to show you guys. All right, so uh, we don't have any mod packs installed, so we need to fix that. Uh, go over here to browse FTB mod packs and you'll get a list of mod packs. You want this one, FTB Revelation. Um, so we're going to click install. And it's going to get started. It does take a while, so uh, just give yourself some time to get it installed. All right, here we are. It is done. So uh, now all you have to do is, and actually, we can actually go to uh, my mod packs. So now we have it here, and this is where you'll usually launch it from. So when you click on mods and then you click Minecraft, it'll dump you on the mod, my, uh, my mod packs tab. And you'll see it here. We can just hit play. And it's going to launch Minecraft in the background here. It's downloading all the stuff it needs for Minecraft. And in a moment here, we're going to be asked to log in. All right. So now the launcher is up. I'm already logged in because I was logged in before. But usually you'll have to log in with your Minecraft account. But that's no big deal. Um, one thing you're going to want to do before you get started is go into your launch options and click this profile here. This is your FTB revelation profile in Minecraft. Um, there's one thing you're going to want to change here, and that is how much memory you have allocated. Here it's allocating uh, three gigs, uh, which might be enough, but you might have some slowdown uh, with all the mods that it's loaded. So um, if you have the RAM available, I would highly recommend changing this. Um, I have a, a, a buttload of RAM, but um, I'm going to just put, let's say, six gigs. That'll be more than enough. Uh, honestly, four or five gigs would probably be enough. But if you just change that value to 6G, Instead of the 3072M, just change it to 6, capital G. Uh, the capital is important. Um, that'll change it to 6 gigs, and you should be good. So um, I think that's going to be it. We can leave everything else the same. Yes. OK. And then we just go back over to News, and we have the click play button. There we go. We click it, and uh, we'll be off in a moment here. All right, so FTB is loading. Um, this can take a while, depending on how much memory you have available and how fast your CPU is, but it is loading a lot of mods, and it is not unusual for it to take quite a while, maybe even up to 10 minutes, uh, depending on your system resources. So if you don't have a super fast computer, just be patient. Um, it'll load eventually. Uh, for me, it usually takes like maybe three or four minutes, so we're going to skip ahead here. And here we are. So uh, if you would like to play on my community server, all you have to do is go here to multiplayer, and we want to add a server. We're going to call this Dagon Mars House of Horrors. It doesn't really matter what you uh, put there. It's just whatever you want it called. Uh, and the address is going to be ftb.daganmar.tv, and it's the default Minecraft port, so you don't have to put a port there, so that's all you have to do, ftb.daganmar.tv, hit done, and 
Ta-da, there it is. All you have to do is click that, join server, and we are done. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be it, everybody. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.